think uh, it's such... There's, there's no athleticism in lifting weights. I mean, I, I, I lift weights every day. Uh, you know, we run, we train, we do a whole bunch of stuff. But at the end of the day, like moving a, a weight from point A to point B, like doesn't take athleticism. Some really unathletic people do that. Mm-hmm. And, you know, you can be in phenomenal shape and look the part, but like the ability to be able to move through space and to have people look and be like, holy shit. Like I was watching some of your videos. I mean, there's just some of the aerials you were doing were incredible. Oh, like, thanks. dude, this, uh, th- this guy's athletic. He can move through <laughs> space. He, you know, strong, like, you know, watching you actually explore blow and get you know some vertical displacement like that stuff to me is impressive uh oh, watching thank people you so much, lift John. Thank like you so much. like just watching s- some guy squat big weight like i'm like uh like I, I to me um like it's a great display of strength but like what i want to see is i want to be impressed by people's athleticism i want to see uh people move really well i i, I just am, am obsessed with the idea of like it, so Years ago, um, somebody asked me, like, we were at a seminar and people were like, well, how do you know what good movement is? And I was like, how do you not know what good movement is? Everybody can see it. You have this inherent coach's eye, like just for like the same deal. Like if we were sitting at a restaurant, we're sitting at a cafe and, you know, in Portugal and all of a sudden, uh, you know, from a distance, I can hear a front engine V12 Ferrari come up. Right. And all of a sudden that Ferrari pulls off and I'm not a Ferrari fan. I'm more of a Porsche fan, hmm. but I appreciate not only the sound that Ferrari takes the time to, to tune their engines, but the, uh, but like the lines and the color and the attention to detail, there isn't a single person, not even if they're a car person that sees that Ferrari pull up and hears it and sees it that doesn't think, Oh shit, that's a beautiful car. Just like, uh, if all of a sudden a, a beautiful girl walks down the street, every person whether or not they, you know, cat call whistle or just kind of go on their way, thinks like, wow, that's a really pretty girl. I was, you know, like smoke show. So like, that's the same thing with, with movement. We have this inherent coach's eye where we know symmetry and beauty and what looks good. Um, uh, you know, and then all of a sudden, like, you know, you see people lift weights and you see people do things and like instantly you get this kind of coach's eye where you're like, man, that kind of, that's aesthetically pleasing. I like how they did that. That looks good. And uh, that was a pretty interesting point within our seminar being like, when you compete, watch people lift weights, you know whether or not it's good or bad, right? Based off of like, if you want to throw up in your mouth because it looks like they broke their spine on something, that's a problem. You have to stop them. And then your goal as a coach is to get them and use, you know, cues, accessory work, whatever it looks like, or, you know, time, whatever, you know, whatever levers I have to pull to make their movement from point A to point B the best looking and aesthetically pleasing like that, like that should be the goal of every coach. And you know, when, um, when I played football, the goal was to be able to move through space and make it look seamless and effortless. Like I can, you know, the ball is snapped. I move through space. I punch, everything looks perfectly timed and nothing looks awkward. Everything looks very deliberate and perfect. And like, that is what everybody should be striving for. The problem is, is that if you're just moving a barbell from point A to point B, what does that really teach me about athleticism? It doesn't. It's just a foundational movement to make me strong that allows me to go do other things. The problem is a lot of these guys, they don't fucking do anything else. 